show. <laughs> My name is Logan Beck, Xiaobei, and I am currently living here in Taiwan. Now, if you guys know me, I love languages. I think languages are the prettiest things in the world, and it's something that everyone should be learning. I am also a big advocate for going out there and learning languages, trying hard and finding all the best options to learn and to improve your language. I love to look around for these ways, for these methods to get better language studying. And one of the ways that I've found out is speaking to natives. Well, today on the Morning Mijiang Show, we are doing something special. We are having a Morning Mijiang app review. App review. Okay guys, I'm really excited for this one. This is a fun app that I ran across. It's called Hi Native. It is an app to help you connect with other natives of the language that you are learning so you can improve and better learn the language that you're trying to learn and vice versa, where you can help other people learn a language. This is a great tool and something that I love. I love to use. And today, I am gonna be showing you all about it. We're gonna be talking about it so you guys can have the chance to put this into your language study. So, let's go over the specs of this great app, Hi Native. Hi Native supports over 110 languages. This is a lot of languages, guys. So, the ones that you want to learn, they're probably going to be inside this app. You can download Hi Native on iOS and Android. You can also use it in your browser. You can sign up via email, Twitter, or Facebook, which I'm gonna be showing you in just a moment. Question forms make asking questions simple and easy. You can get answers to your questions from native speakers of your target language. And this is the main key of the language, and this is what I love the best about it. You can upload audio to get feedback on your pronunciation and even get voice answers back from native speakers. This is this is probably the best tool in here. I'm gonna be showing you that as well. The core high native experience is free to use, guys. This app is completely free to use, but they also have some extra features which you have to be a premium member to use, which they give you a week free to test it out, and it is such a wonderful app. So guys, let's dive into this. I wanna show you a bit how to set it up first, how to use the app, and why it's so good. So guys, let's get going. Okay, so the app setup is very, very easy. Once you open up the app and you let it open, you'll have options to sign in with Twitter, Facebook, or Language 8. You can also use your email. We're gonna be doing that soon. When you use Facebook, it's super easy. All you do is hit the Facebook tab, it brings you to another page, and you just click through the buttons and log in through your Facebook. If you do choose to do email, we're going to do that today with an account that we are going to be using. You go in here and you put in your username, your email address, and then of course, your password. Okay, once you have signed in, this is where you choose your language that you are fluent in. It could be English, Chinese, or wherever you're from, it'll be that native language. Then, you just go in to choose the languages you're interested in. Now I'm going to go down and choose Chinese of Taiwan. And when you go in there, you can click different levels. Beginner all the way to advanced. I'm gonna be clicking advanced because I feel like that's where I'm at. After that, the app will actually help you go in, learn a lot more about how the app works, to test some things out and get you going. We're going to skip that part. I'm going to get you right into the key points, my very favorite features of this app. Are you guys ready? Let's check it out. So when you first open up the app, you're going to see in the very middle, there's going to be a little ask button. You just want to click that and then you will see lots of different things. How to say this, how is my pronunciation, please show me how to pronounce, and lots of other questions that you can put in to ask other natives or people interested in that language. So before I went ahead and I took a picture of this beautiful Mijiang bottle, and I want to ask a native, because maybe I don't know Chinese, I want to ask a native how to say what's on this bottle. So you just go in there and because I want to say it more in traditional Chinese, I'm going to put traditional Chinese as the option and I'm going to be typing, what does this say? I'm going to type it in Chinese to go on some. So I'm going to put the picture on there and they're going to be helping me translate it. So let's put the picture on. There we go. And it is now loaded. So what we are going to do now is we are now going to go into the answers and see what they left us. Let's go check this out. This is some sort of peanut soy milk. The package mainly says it's traditional and has passed food safety regulations. So 
This is really great. This is a great way to get things. You can do photos, you can do voice, you can do lots of other things. I'm going to be showing you those. Let's jump into the next section. Okay, so we all run across words that sometimes we don't know the best way to translate them. And the best would be going to a native that knows both of those languages. So let's go into the Ask tab and let's ask how to translate Mijang. All you do again, you open Ask, you, is the best way to translate Mijang. Now, what's really nice is with all these users, answers can come back super quick. So let's go check the answer feed. So rice milk or rice paste. Rice milk, rice and peanut butter milk, rice milk. So there's lots of really good answers all coming from these natives, which makes the answer very great. It is time to find the best way to get a pronunciation. Because pronunciation is very important, especially when speaking the language. I just want to ask the crowd how to pronunciate Mijiang. So let's just type it in right here. And all the speakers that know Chinese will be helping me out by putting in their answers. So let's check these out. Mijiang. These are all really good. Mijiang. Mijiang. <laughs> with this app, you can also help other people. So I want to go around the forums and we can go help other people with their questions. So I'm going to go open up my tab where it says English. And let's go see if there's anyone in here that has anything good. Okay, so we're just scrolling down right here and uh, here we go. So this is a native Japanese speaker and he's asking a question. He said, my father is the owner of the Japanese small restaurant. Does this sound natural? What I love about this is there's the option where you can ask if it sounds natural. There's lots of things that we think we can translate ourselves, but it's great to be able to ask if it sounds natural. So let's help this guy out. So I read that and you know what? I'm thinking it sounds a little unnatural, so I'm going to give him that answer. And now I want to type back what can be better so he can improve his own language. So I'm going to pop open to English and I want to type in the best answer. So my father is the owner of a small, let me see if I got this, Japanese restaurant. Now this answer is going to be a lot better. It's going to help this guy get a better, more native response. Now the very last section that I want to show you guys is one that I think is just amazing. Now this is where you can help people get better answers to their pronunciation. So I'm going to be scrolling down this list and I want to go find one to help someone. So they put right here, we have a native Portuguese speaker. And they put, how is my pronunciation? Please record yours too. So I'm going to listen to it. I've never heard something like that. Okay, I've never heard something like that. It sounds great, right? But let's help her out a little bit more and let's get a better answer for her. So all I need to do is I can tell her, hey, you know, that was great, but I'm going to give you something better. Here, let's go for it. I've never heard something like that. Anyways, I had so much fun going over this app. I'm also glad that I can help you guys find different ways to learn your language. If it's English, Chinese, Portuguese, Spanish, whatever it may be, this is a great app to increase your level of that language. You can get better knowledge from it and you can speak more like a native. Because of course the app is called Hi Native. So I suggest you guys all go download this. You may just see my name in there. Logan D. Beck, and maybe we can help one another with a language. If you guys like these app reviews or any other kind of review, let me know. I would love to do more to help you guys in any different kind of field. Okay guys, this is so fun to do this. If you're new, hit that subscribe button. I do lots of things with Chinese and going around Taiwan. If you're interested in that, do hit that subscribe button. Okay guys, I think you all know the drill. Until next time, I'll see you in Taiwan. Hello Taiwan and hello Taipei. Go man.
good job. <laughs>